A neck of humerus fracture refers to a break in the upper part of the arm bone, humerus, near the shoulder joint. This type of fracture can happen due to various reasons, such as a fall on an outstretched hand or a direct blow to the shoulder. Here's a simplified description of its presentation and treatments for a layperson. Pain. You will experience significant pain in your shoulder and upper arm areas. The pain may be sharp or throbbing. Swelling. There can be noticeable swelling around the injured area, which may develop soon after the injury. Bruising. Some bruising or discoloration might appear on the skin near the shoulder or upper arm due to bleeding from the fracture site. Limited movement. It may be challenging to move your shoulder and upper arm normally, and you might not be able to lift or rotate your arm. Deformity. Sometimes, the shoulder area may look deformed or out of its normal alignment. Immobilization. Your healthcare provider will likely immobilize your arm to prevent further injury. This could involve a sling or a special brace. Pain management. Over-the-counter pain relievers or prescribed medications may be given to help manage the pain. Surgery. In more severe cases or if the fracture is displaced, the broken pieces are not aligned, surgery may be necessary to realign the bone fragments and secure them with pins, plates, or screws. Dr. Nihel Fernando, a renowned orthopedic surgeon in Kandy, is doing proximal humerus, hillock, plate implantation for a misplaced humerus head, as shown in this educational what is that video. Is called? She just it again. Um. Physical therapy. Once the fracture starts healing, you might be referred to a physical therapist. They will guide you through exercises to regain strength and mobility in your arm and shoulder. Follow-up. Regular follow-up visits with your healthcare provider are crucial to monitor the healing process and adjust your treatment plan. Rest and recovery. Resting your injured arm and following your healthcare provider's instructions are essential for a successful recovery. It's important to note that the specific treatment approach can vary based on the severity of the fracture and the individual's overall health. If you suspect a neck or humerus fracture or have experienced a shoulder injury, it's crucial to seek medical attention promptly to receive the appropriate care and ensure the best possible outcome for your recovery.